Hey, I'm Anastasia. This is Anastasia's Hump Day Happenings. April is Oral Cancer Awareness Month. Big in the news this week was HPV vaccine, Gardasil. What they want to do is they're finding in young men, ages 12 and over, it saves money and it's more cost effective to give them the vaccine. 9,300 men in the United States are impacted or affected by HPV related throat cancers. And it's four times more likely to happen to men than women. And let's just add more icing on the cake, shall we? Men between the ages of 40 and 50. HPV can last in your system for years and years and years. So what they're suggesting is, you know, to start vaccinating with Gardasil by the ages of 12. Now I understand this, and as a parent, I'm not one, that is your decision, but this is what I know. Your dental professional should really have the conversation with you. Many think it's taboo and it's awkward, we can't talk about it. Guess what, HPV is a risk factor, you need to talk about it. Here's three things I need you to do. Number one, parents, or dental professionals. When you're looking at your health history, we check it every single time. Oh, they're ages 12 and over and they have, share that with your dental professional, dental pros, same thing, ask the questions. If you have somebody that's maybe 14, this thing's been out a while, so start asking questions. It'll also help lead you into the conversation that you feel is awkward, all right? Number two, you need to know where are HPV related throat cancers. They are usually on the back or base of your tongue going into your throat and your tonsil area. That's number three, and finally, you've got to have an oral cancer screening at least once a year, and I'm talking technology. It's a light that really excites the cells, and we can see if there's any changes going on because any dentist that doesn't use technology and you're just saying, everything looks good, really? Really, you can see cellular changes with your eyes or even your loops. I'm doubting it because if so, then you can see high cholesterol. If so, then tell me what my uh, blood pressure is. You really need to have this technology. That's what it's there for. It's all about prevention and information. So that saves lives. Now you got a question for me? Ask it. Hashtag Ask Anastasia. Otherwise, till next Wednesday, take what you learn and make a difference with it.